its creators say Vertical 2 could one day rival delivery drones like Amazon Prime Air and Google's Project Wing. University of Leuven researchers say it combines a quadcopter's vertical takeoff and landing ability with conventional aircraft speed and capacity for longer flight. And when we take off, it flies like a multicopter and all the lift is generated by the four propellers. After takeoff, we make a transition and we tilt the whole vehicle uh, 45 degrees. And after this, the wings provide a lot of lift and the propellers do not consume so much energy anymore. When we want to land, we just make a transition back to hover and all the lift is back provided with the propellers and we can land vertically on a very small spot. The team's first model performed well in field tests but struggled in windy conditions. Vertical 2 smaller wings make it more wind tolerant. We are now uh, ready to fly fully autonomously with the vertical. Um, it's also possible to land with, uh, very precise, uh, in a very precise position of uh, 10 cm. We use a very accurate uh, real-time kinematic GPS uh, for that. And uh, in the next stage we want to uh, automatically exchange uh, batteries and uh, a package uh, out of our drone. With an automatic flight controller tilting the craft forward so its top becomes its nose, the drone can travel for 30 kilometers with a one kilogram payload. With more funding, its creators say it won't be long before Vertical 2 takes its place in the delivery drone's very own Battle of the Skies.